I don't have a clue where I am. Well, I, I'm in Taoyuan City somewhere. Yeah, so that's all I'm saying. Uh, keep a, just, you know. So you, you, if you Google, if, the thing is, if, if you Google, uh, if you Google a sickness, what you can find out is what the normal length of time for the sickness to to run its to to to, to, to the, the normal lifespan for a sickness is, and that's what you need to know. Like if it says, okay, your son has this kind of a problem, it normally lasts six days. You know, so what you do is you don't go to the doctor. You just wait six days, and if the kid gets better, then well, shit. You know, now he's he's now he's now immune to that problem, and everything's fine and dandy. But if you wait six days and he's still just as bad as before, or, he, or he's not improving, well, then maybe you should go see the doctor. That's that's the point. You know, you don't just kid sick go to the doctor. Plus, the dumb thing about it is, is whenever a kid is sick, you know, that's when their their immune system is is very often at its weakest. And then you take them to a doctor's office, it's full of sick people. So the, you got your kids, um, your, your own kid's immunity, is, immune, immune system is at its weakest, and then you take them to a place that's full of sick people. Like, where's the logic? Me, personally, I only take my son to the doctor when he's totally healthy. And that's a joke, but um bum I vaguely remember this road. I used to, yeah, I remember this road. I used to go riding with a, a group a group of guys, and, and uh, they were based in Taliyuan, and then whenever they would head back into Taliyuan, they would take this road back into the city. It's a nice road. Now we're going up a mountain. Yeah, just then I noticed that my arms were too tense. I just focused on it. My elbows were up, and then I realized, and they're kind of tense, so I just kind of relaxed them, and they fell down. As soon as I relaxed my arms, both my arms, the elbows just dropped. They went from sideways to down. And that's something you need to keep aware of, especially when you're cornering. Your arms should not be tensed. If you're tense, then you're, you're actually fighting the steering, and you're, and, you're, and you're increasing your chance of having an accident. It's not a good road to live on, baby. And what the hell is this? I don't have a clue, but let's check it out. Ooh, oh cool. We can just skip the driveway and go in here. 